Worldwide, I have QTV, it's Shorty Brown here. We are in New York City for 2009. It is the end of October and we are here. We just saw Guy Asif's film, The Blue Balloon, and it was awesome. Guy, now how is it uh, screening here in New York City? It's absolutely beautiful, it's a great festival. And it's so nice to see so many new movies, so much talent, so much, so many stories that are filled with so much heart. And those, this is the perfect place and probably the only place where somebody can experience something like this, that you won't go to the movie theaters, you won't be able to see you know, all the special effects, but you'll get the story. And that, that's why you get so inspired. That's why I, you know, I can spend a whole day here and just get filled with so much appreciation to the people who are actually giving you know, they're sold to the movie industry. Well, I mean, it's awesome. There's like people from all around the world here at the festival. I mean, what sort of people have you met and from what countries? I've met people from France, a great director from Peru. Uh, I've met uh, people from Canada, people from Toronto, which we were made the uh, contacts with uh, from the gala opening night all the way through the films. And uh, people from Netherlands that came up with a beautiful, beautiful film and it's just, I'm in Oz. By and the now, now, where are you from? I'm from Toronto originally, from Canada. And the, the movie that I actually shot was filmed in south of France in an enchanted town called Aix-en-Provence. And uh, it's been shot last year. It just recently been finished. And uh, it's world premiering here. And hopefully it'll start circulating and more people will catch the, the message of the blue balloon. Now, yeah, what does the blue balloon symbolize? Or uh, is that a secret? <laughs> Well, the blue balloon is basically uh, a message that is universal. It's a story about a, a blue balloon that is searching for a friend and searching for somebody to love and to play with him and to be loved. And really, this is what we all are about as humans. We are uh, looking for people and we're connecting with people. And the movie is about the interaction of the blue balloon with the people and the way that the people interact among themselves. And none of the people in this film are actors. It's all been actually happening as I was there. Is it the one shot? It is. It's 11 minutes of uh, continuous shot footage, which was edited down to six minutes. And uh, yeah, I've been there. And uh, had I been there five minutes before or five minutes after, the story wouldn't have been told. So I wow. were able to capture the moment and tell the story. Well, uh, and so um, how uh, did people perceive your film um, in there? Well, in Toronto, people actually uh, fell in love with the blue balloon. And uh, for me, it was uh, a story that I found that I had to move on and tell. And uh, the blue balloon came with me. And uh, it's, a, it's a great way to having an actor that is uh, not uh, too fussy and will go with you, will go along with whatever you uh, bring him up to. And uh, it's cheap on the flights. And, right, right, right. Yeah, and yeah. He's, he's my main actor. So he's I, I love it. The story. I love it. Hey. Blue Balloon, keep an eye out for it. It's just such a cute, awesome movie to see. The Blue Balloon, New York International Independent Film and Video Festival. Thank you very much.